Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the stream, dude. Today we are playing Arno Surge, a good game by Guest. You know Guest. They made Atelier Ryza. Yeah, this one's a little bit spicier than um, that game, though. As I'm sure you're quite aware. I am um, now. Mm. <laughs> but that doesn't mean this game is a bad game. It just has a few weird moments. Alright, since we're like level 30, I guess we could continue. Uh oh, more enemies. Let's attack them with the power of enemy Sundre. Yes, that, that, that's definitely a thing you can do in this game, man. There we go, beat them up. Easy. All I gotta do is beat up the ones that are attacking you. But you can see which ones those are gonna be. Alright, I believe our song is fully charged. Let's do it. did it. Look at all that XP we got. Excellent. Of course, what we are here for is for these. Let's grab a couple of these things off the ground. Ah, yes. I do want to do more crafting today. First, I would like to get some money together. Let's go in here and find out what's going on. I bet the Char will have, like, everybody brainwashed and hypnotized. What is this? Wait, what is that? Hey, that looks like something you might find in the, um, Tower Inn's Tales of Symphonia. Look. Jill. Jill's up ahead. We gotta beat her. She's activating some sort of song magic inside that spear. Wait, what? What's going on? It's Eo. I know Eo. He's a good girl. It's begun. The world has finally started to move Wait, who are you? Aren't you the girl that was inside the containment? Inside, um... The little house? We gotta stop her. Ah, that sound is overwhelming, man. Wait, what? What do you mean? What does any of this mean? <laughs> Wait, what? What are you talking about? I don't understand. And again, I don't understand anything about this plot. Yes, we're going to wipe out humanity. That's what we're talking about. Yeah, I knew that, yes, this is an RPG. Gods are going to wipe out humanity. Yeah. It happens every Tuesday in JRPG land. I get the feeling we're going to engage in a boss fight or something. Oh, she's summoning Cthulhu to wipe out the- to crush the heretics and to crush the sinners, I guess. Enemy Charles. Wait, what, why is there a bunny girl? Uh, oh, 
Alright, let's use this one, I guess. No, oh, no, I don't really like this one, but it's okay. Oh, it's healing, okay. Okay, that's not really gonna help it. I need you to go over here and beat this one up. Right through, and beat it up. Alright, we got a bonus turn. Oh, we can activate our song magic, can't we? But we can't hear it. Boom. Wipe out. Those weren't very strong. But we should have wiped out the entire waves then. These are the seeds which you have sown. What the fuck are you talking? I mean, what are you talking about? I've done nothing. There were, there were humans who offered themselves in obedience. No. You shall form the foundation of our new the creation of a new Yeah, she wants to create a new perfect world and wipe out everybody. Something terrible has happened. You must leave now. Doctor? What's wrong? What Siona's surge has been activated. A tremendous number of Charles are being created at the placenta. Wait, what? They're being created? What? 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 Your location here is too vulnerable. You must ret I can't do that. Delta and Cass are out there fighting. If you are captured, no one will be able to stop Sielno's surge. If that happens, then it really will be over. And I am worried about you. Yes, we gotta stop the cult somehow. Stop Sielno's surge. Oh, why did you develop this song then if you... Why did we develop... Why did... Was the song developed in the first place? Resolve this crisis as quickly as possible. What do we do? By the way, I know who Sielno's surge has been installed into. Oh, wait, who? What? Then why didn't you say anything? If I had mentioned it out of nowhere, you would have been too surprised. Wait, why it's been installed in Delta? Oh, I'm still pretty surprised. Iona Sol. Oh, Iona Sol? Iona Sol Kakura Presiel. Oh, that's who it's been installed in. It's been installed in Eo, but what about Delta then? Wait. She has been made Jill's puppet. To stop the stream of Charles, we must awaken her. Okay, do it. And we must discern how to do so soon. Yeah. You promised you wouldn't ask me any questions like that? I know, but you have to understand where I'm coming from. We both know I couldn't have ever found that out. Anyway, I appreciate... Then first, you must stop Cielno's... Okay, let's awaken our next part. Let's awaken our next... But they, let's awaken the next character we can play as. Delta? What? We've been taken captive. I can hear the budding of Sharon O'Ire. The time for humans to repent has come at last. They shall all be guided to this sea of atonement. Yeah, they're gonna sacrifice them for the power of God. Delta's tracking has been lost. Wait, what? Alternate target, what? So who's who's secretly behind all this? That should do it. Hello? There we go, EO. Hello. Oh no. My internet's bad. All the wiring is right. Um are you there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm right here. Wow, wow, you really are there. Congrats, Aerie. I thought I'd really messed up something for a minute there. It's nice to meet you. My name is Yonasal Kukulu Presio. You can call me Eon. I built you myself. Can you move? Sure, I can move. That's yeah, she's from the first game that we never got in the West. Okay, what do we have to do? So, will you... That's not too much to ask, right? 
I don't understand, but I'll help. Yeah, we're gonna be nice, guys. Well, um, we're gonna be nice to her, at least. Yeah. We're gonna be friendly, yeah. Damn, we do not... Damn, we don't have much armor on. What do you need me to do? I just said there's somebody named Malifor nearby who runs it. I was thinking I would start by asking her about all this. Wait, what is this place? This place looks weird. Here, let's go. This is weird. What's with the weird music? Jump, jump, like a kangaroo. Alright, we appear to be stuck in some sort of delusion of some sort. Or maybe we're in Wonderland? Maybe we- maybe Eo's been taken to Fairyland and that's why they're doing stuff to her. That's a world wall, we gotta break through. Let's just bash right on through. You should just bash through it. Let's go ask Nelico about it. Wait, what? A bunny girl? Those are some nice stockings, though. I like those. Hey, wait a minute. Wait, aren't you Jill? Wait, what? My skin's looking nice? Um... No. So, what brings you here today? Huh? What's this big pile of junk? This is a robot, as you probably already know. Um, that's you. Me? I know it's a pile of junk. You're a pile of junk. What are you saying? I'm not a hunk of old metal. Does living alone find me driving you crazy? No. What I meant was you shouldn't call him junk. He's an avatar, I guess. Yes, I am. Yes, I am a robot. I am robots. I am beep boop. Um, something, something, something. Robots would say. You will be assimilated. You will be deleted. Yes, I am a Cyberman, or possibly a Borg. I don't know. Delete, delete. <laughs> yes, we're on the quest to delete everybody's emotions. Yeah. Just like Cyrus did in Pokemon. Or rather, he tried to, anyway, before Garatina was like, Oh, no. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, by the way, Garatina's the best legendary. <laughs> because Garatina is a big, spoopy ghost. And also a dragon. That's a ghost. A ghost dragon, if you will. It's super spooky, and it also is a lord of ant dark matter. Which is full of darkness within darkness and edge. Remember? What you thought? You've always lived no, I did it. Okay, I guess I could. Of course you put yourself into it. Cloudy Planet Nelly Toarco. You live under a rock. It's the most popular SF drama among men and women of all ages right now. You SF? You mean sci-fi? Or Street Fighter? Is it a Street Fighter drama? I'm just kidding. It's probably sci-fi. Or science fiction. Right, science fiction. All right, then, let's give it a spin, I guess. Let's spin to win. Yay, I like Vin I like these machines. They remind me of Gotcha. Back when Gotcha was good and not in every video game. 
Yeah, sorry, I don't like gotcha in video games, man. At least some of them have fair gotcha. The pity pools. But I don't really play gotcha myself. But you know who does play gotcha? DSP. Unfortunately, he doesn't do cute anime girls like in Genshin Impact. Nah. He does sweaty men JPEGs. Not so good, man. Go find a thing. Okay. Let's go find a thing. There's a lot of different materials around here. Really? Uh oh. Wow, those are a bunch of old rotary phones. And we outgrew those and have put and got push buttons. No one shining that one. Legendary black rotor dial. Yeah, and then we got push buttons and we got these, and then eventually we got And eventually we got cell phones and smartphones. Rotary phones are what every boomer says that ch kids these days don't know how to use. Oh yeah, but that's because we all got cell phones now which are infinitely better in every way. And can do a million different things. Unlike an old rotary phone. Besides, using a rotary phone's not that bad. Or hard. Nah. Why would a, using a rotary... Besides, everybody knows phone bad, but good. That goes for rotary phones, too. I mean, what sort of person stays all day on a rotary phone anyway? Yeah, everybody knows phone is bad. Phone bad, video good. Oh, well, hmm. <laughs> Yeah, but then maybe in the next thousand, maybe in a few years, um, video games will be replaced by a new form of entertainment. Whatever that may be. Who knows what that be. Also, I like that. Also, Nellico looks a little like Jill. That's a little weird. Unfortunately, it doesn't really come up that much. Maybe it's part of Jill's master plan to manipulate Ion. All right, now. Gotten pretty dangerous, what? Does that mean monsters have appeared? All right, we're gonna fight with, we're gonna fight with herbs. Herbs is pretty good to fight with. Yeah, he's pretty much like Delta. Enemies, enemy Charl are appearing. We gotta be careful, the enemies are dangerous. See, there's waves of enemies. Also, we can pick up new materials now. Wait, what? Aeon, you would mistakenly eat wood powder? Why? Uh-oh, enemies. Alright, let's summon our Heart of Light. That's a cute little guy. Oh boy, there's slimes. Yeah, unfortunately, we don't have all our stuff that is equipped to... We don't have all the equipment that, um, Delta has. But we do have... But we do have this. Damn, that little guy is really powerful. Nice song. <sighs> oh, we're level one, that's why. That's why we're so weak, we're like level one. Yeah, so it's like starting over again. It's like starting over with a new character, man. I was expecting to be like level 30, like Delta. Nah. Not this time. You need to be careful, the enemies, man. To 
Sure thing, Ion. Now, Ion has some interesting personality traits inside of inside of herself. But we can't go into that right now. But trust me, they're pretty um spicy if you might if you catch my drift. No problem, Ion. There you go. Alright, let's do it. I will say her song is really cute, too. She has even spicier stuff than Cast Man in her heart, man. Should we level up again? We should probably level up a few times, huh? Perhaps I should have ended the episode here, man. That way I would have... If I knew this was coming up, I probably would have... Right? I probably would have gone ahead and did the thing. Where we fought, Z where we fought Zill's little Charles, are we? Well. We should have wiped out all the waves of the Charles, but no. The plot wanted us to get captured and lose. But we broke it. Let's break him again. And Earth uses a pistol, unlike Delta, who uses swords. We should probably level up since we're struggling so hard to break these slimes. Good thing Song Magic wipes out all the enemy waves no matter what. Well, if you got it to 100%, that is. Don't worry about Nalico, Miss, Miss Ion. That wall over there looks pretty suspicious. I wonder what's over there. What's this? Luxury bomb. You can even use it to lubricate machines. Oh, no, a vacuum tube? Vacuum tube wouldn't be too bad. An all purpose vacuum tube. But Ion, you like vacuum tubes? Oh, your little buddy does have a bunch of vacuum tubes on it, so I guess, I guess that explains it. Okay, Ayan, I'll get I'll get more. Wait till you see the spicy stuff that's inside her heart, man. That'll be really interesting, I think. Now I'm just trying to grind a few levels. All right, next wave. Load him up with a Kamehameha, man. Damn, that little guy is capable of Kamehameha, man. That means clearly it's related- clearly it's a Super Saiyan, man. Good, we're level 5 now. <sighs> is there anything over here at Ion's house? Wait, what? Why does Ion live in a run-down, run abandoned building? Right, I probably should have mentioned that earlier. Ion's the type of lady that, um... Oh, you'll understand. I really wish we got the first game in the West, man. I hear Arno Surge DX does have... Does bundle with the first game. Man, I really wish we get it... I hope we really get it in the West, man. Hmm. I hope... Hopefully we do. Please, Koi Tecmo and Gus, make it happen, guys. I would really like that. I bet a lot of people who really like it would be into it, man. Alright, like, let's unleash our crusher to break them. We're getting a little bit stronger, that's good.
Let's unleash our Kamehameha, man. There aren't too many enemy waves out here. But that's fine. We are getting strong enough to at least beat the slimes, at least. Damn, almost leveled up again. My apologies for grinding, guys. I hope that's not too off-putting, guys. I really should have ended it in here last episode, huh? That's okay. That's okay, we got plenty of time. Or rather, I got plenty of time. You, on the other hand, are probably getting really bored watching this, man. I mean, it's okay if you're bored, man. Let me know if it's too boring for you, okay? Punish him, punish him, punish him. Yeah. At least the combat in this game is pretty fun. Good, we broke it. Go for that, and then hammer it home. No problem, Ion. And Ion is basically the second character you play as. You do get the ability to swap between her her and Earths and Delta and Cass, obviously. In the final battle, you do get to choose who whoever which one you play as. So you can they can yeah, well it will be a different ending depending on which ones you get now. I already did Del Ion and Earth's ending back when I first played this game. Yeah, it's been a long time since I played this game now. And so unfortunately I don't really remember all that much. I do remember Jill though. Yeah, I keep thinking it's weird that her name is pronounced Jill when it clearly says Zill, man. Yeah, I guess that's a weird fanatics, man. That I'm not really used to. That's okay, we'll keep we'll call her Jill for now on. Anyway, Jill is an evil cult leader, much like um Jill is basically an evil cult leader who is basically like, um, Kenneth Copeland, yeah. Or like any other evil cult leader inside a video game, man. They want to crush the heretics, they want to use, they want to summon Cthulhu to destroy the world. You know, the usual. Hmm. It wouldn't be the first time I fought an evil cultist in a video game that wanted to unleash God's judgment upon the world. Yeah, we, we just we just refer to them as the Illuminati, mainly because of Tales of Azaria. I mainly just refer to them as that because of Tales of Azaria, because the Order of Illuminati is definitely not the Illuminati, and they are definitely not run by Satan, and they are totally not run by an Antichrist figure. <sighs> yeah, sorry, Arthurius is definitely not an Antichrist figure, definitely not. Not that I would know anything about that. <laughs> yes, I have robot. Robots are sec robots are in. Of course, Earth's personality is more up to you rather than Delta's personality, man. Yeah, you're the one that's controlling Earth directly. Yeah, there's actually a little related reason for that, but I can't tell you that right now. But you didn't. But you don't know. Well, it's gonna become relevant in the end game, man. It's some. Yeah, basically, it's something to do with self-awareness in this game, man. Oh, we leveled up to seven. That's good. That's good. We could level up a couple times. We could level up a couple more times, though. I just want to be strong enough to take on enemies that are late, that are later in the game, man. Of course, it will be possible to get to level. It's possible to get to the levels pretty easily in this game since you're fighting waves and waves of enemies, and they give pretty good experience. Well, it's not too hard to grind, especially in an endgame where there's like a wave of 50 enemies 
towards the end that give you tons of experience and a whole bunch of mats to play around with. Which lets you do crafting pretty well, too. Get him. I want to be at least strong enough to be able to take on weaker enemy, weak enemies right now. Since we're starting at level 1 with both of them. Don't worry, Ion. I will get more. I will definitely give you more. Wipe out all the waves. Easy. Alright, what level are we at? Now we need 29 more experience. Pretty sure if I defeat one more wave, we'll be able to level up, maybe. I do like this little place. Kind of growing on me, man. Maybe I'm just used to. Maybe I'm just used. Maybe I just like Wonderland too much. A little too much. By the way, the book is vastly different from the from the Disney movie. And also, Alice in Wonderland is totally different from most interpretations of Alice in Wonderland. And that Alice in Wonderland is typically portrayed as bad, as very edgy with its badness. Hmm. In most forms of media, I really don't blame I really don't blame people for doing that, but it's not really that edgy to be honest. The edginess in the first out in the Alice in Wonderland book is a lot more subtle than most interpretations do. Mainly because at the time mainly because at the time Alice in Wonderland did come out, there were people that were like um people today with video games and stuff. Well actually every time periods had things like every every time periods definitely had Puritans and stuff like that. But not, 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 we're not here to talk about that, no. Oh well. Oh well, it won't matter anymore, no. I get the feeling there's gonna be a pretty big pushback against things like that. As there always is. I would definitely... There's definitely a little spot on that wall over there. Keep doing that? Keep doing what? Now she really wants me to break them. Sure, I'll break them for you. Beating him up? Sure. Anything for Miss Ion, man. I like her a little bit more than Cass. Maybe... Mainly because Cass is basically a generic anime tsundere. And I'm sorry, anime tsundere's are not that good. Sorry, I don't like Sundarays. They're just a little too generic for me, man. Not that Cass doesn't have personality, she does. It's just I like Ion a little bit better. This is a world wall. Maybe we can find some what about breaking it? I can break it. I am a tough robot. I can break anything. But I'm more, more like stone and metal. An explosive. We can try making a bomb. Let's do that. Let's do it. Let's blow it up. I never actually made a bomb before. We need, oh, we need a few. We need some materials that we already picked up. Okay. okay. So we need materials to break the bomb, but we already got the materials. So we can go break. We can go make the bomb right away and break the wall. You can't tell Nelico about this because she's actually Jill. Well, she does. Maybe she's just, maybe she's still some sister that's a little bit more, um. 
Or maybe she's a rejection of Ion's mind because she's trapped in stasis or something. She's trying to keep Ion here, that's what. What is this world? This world was created for you. But here for the greater good of the rest of the world. Are we destroying the balance out there? No. That's why you shouldn't. You can't leave. No. I want to leave because the world needs me. I can't believe that I'm going to destroy the balance. He's okay. Yeah, she is a cute bunny girl. I like that red I like that coat of hers. It looks a bit like an Alice in Wonderland character. If you try to leave, this world will turn against you. Is that why the monsters have suddenly appeared? That way we're being attacked by slimes. Yeah, Dragon it wouldn't be a video it wouldn't be an RPG without slimes, guys. Slimes are the bread and brother of RPG monsters. They're the weakest minion of all minions, man. But I like slimes. Slimes are cute and sexy. Or I mean, um, no. Um, slime girls are not sexy, no. I don't know anything about slime girls, man. Certainly not. Wait, um, what? Slime girls, what? I'm sorry, we're talking about slimes, and these are, um... Actually, these guys look like they're out of they're out of Mario Galaxy. Like those little leeches that get on you, man. That's what these guys look like. Alright, time to activate the song and Kamehameha these guys. Glad we're getting a little bit stronger, at least. world's gonna turn against us, huh? It was created by- it was created for her by- to keep her inside, man. We need to break out. Let's break out of this prison, man. Hey, Asharo, what are they doing here? Uh, what are you doing here? Nice weather we're having. I'm totally not here to kidnap you or anything. By the way, can we appreciate how um cute these are look? Oh, wait. Uh, or I mean, no. There are enemies, yeah. Yeah, but to be fair, they're under the control of a virus created by Jill. Yeah. Some sort of fairy virus that's controlling them using iron. Or something. Nitro World Breaker? It's a bomb! Wait, a bomb? That's not a thwack, that's a boom! Big bomb! And Ion has the best bombs of all the girls in this series, man. Or, I mean, um... Certainly Jill has big bombs, but, um... Ion definitely has big bombs. I'm sure she ran away, yeah. We didn't kill her. All right, now let's break out of the world. All right, should we tell Nelico that we're leaving? I'll just grab this. Yoink. Yo, we blew a hole in the wall. I'm sorry, I'm going to upset the balance of the world. Or something by my awakening. Even though we know that's complete bollocks. Damn, look, we blew a hole in the wall. 
Damn, I was trying to escape, but some enemies, but some slimes are trying to stop me. Hmm, I love slimes in video games, man. These guys look like they give delicious chew jelly. They're like the chews in Breath of the Wild, man. I would play Breath of the Wild, but I'm not very good at game. I'm not very good at Zelda games. And Breath of the Wild is definitely not an easy Zelda, man. Yeah, I'm not very good at video games in general anyway. I try to do the best I can, though. Sometimes I do get lost and confused and don't know what to do. Sadly, I don't think we'll run into that issue with this game. Unless I, unless I'm deliberately beaming it up and he he ha ha funny moment, doing it, man. What do I do, dude? Uh, what do I do? <laughs> it's a studio set. It's just a studio set, huh? All right, let's run away. Oh, it's so dark, like my soul. Do you think jumping down is the way out? Maybe. Uh, I think so. Yeah, that's that's kind of scary. You should calm down. Alika, we're we're leaving. If you jump down that hole, bad things are gonna happen. All you'll know is sorrow. What's so bad about this world? He's here, I'm here, there's no war, nobody hates anybody. Sorry, but we're leaving. Don't you think it would be better to just stay here forever? It's so peaceful. No. Don't, don't fall for it. She's actually Jill. It's not that I don't like it here, but there's something I have to do, and I can't do it here. That's why I have to go. Yeah, we're gonna upset the balance of the world and save and um, destroy it. Yeah. What if you do, then I'll be <sighs> Sorry, guys. Nobody will come to my store, and I won't have any friends to invite to dinner. It'll be just me. Without you, I won't have a reason to exist. If you leave, eventually, I'll just disappear. Oh no. What are you saying? Please don't do it. I don't want to disappear. I want to stay here with you. I know this is a small, lonely world, but it's a lot more fun if we're together. Don't fall for it. Please, Keeper, just think. I... Don't be guilt tripped by her. No, she's actually Jill. I thought that would be the most effective strategy, but what? You were trying to you were trying to trick us. I'm afraid I have to put you to sleep properly. Wait, what? No. What? Listen to my song. <laughs> I knew she I knew she was actually evil. But what's that weapon she's using? I wipe out one enemy. Alright, let's wipe out this slime here. This is why we level up, guys. Alright, we broke her. That's good. That means we can pile on the damage again. 
And she's getting a turn in. Luckily, she only has one attack per turn. Good, we beat her. And can't use song magic because it's locked. You're locked out of it during a real boss fight. Tell me, what? Who are you? Of course, I'm not. Ugh. It's okay. I am an astrocyte modulation virus. Wait, what? She's actually a virus. Wait, I must have missed that the first time. That's a virus to use to control the Charl. A virus? Yes. I was created to keep you inside this world. Yes, she was created by Chill. That's why it looks like her, man. Synergy between myself and a program called CL No Surge. So basically, you are evil. I knew it. I've been creating Charl. What, what, what does that mean? The world needs Charl to save it. A whole lot of Charl. In other words, they're going. In other words, the Charl have been created by the. Wait, um, Ion created all the Charl. What? Yes. Exactly. Why didn't I realize this before? Your memories were shattered. You didn't even know who you were. That's probably why you thought you were part of this world. That meant I didn't have to try and prevent you from leaving. I never thought it would turn out like this, though. Your partner here turned out to be quite a bit of trouble. Yeah, sorry about that. If I jump down there, will I go back to the real world? You really think I'm gonna answer that? Please answer it. I do. Because I don't think you're actually a bad person. I'm a virus sent to control you using mind control. Of course I'm a bad person. <laughs> well, you're right. I'm not even a person at all. Yes, if you jump, you'll wake up. Okay, thank you. If crying, begging, and fighting won't stop you, there's nothing I can do. I'm done. But I promise that when you do wake up, you'll regret it. No. Your awakening will destroy the world itself. Nobody wants you to be there. No, it won't. Huh. Then have a good life, Lighthouse Keeper. We didn't spend much time together. We will likely never meet again. Okay, let's go. Let's jump out of this world and get away from the crazy little virus. And, um, we escaped Wonderland and now we're awake. Oh, good morning, Miss Lighthouse Keeper. Why are you up so soon? Yeah, I woke up. This is... You're Nello. Yes, it's been a while. You're up a little early, though. So do you think you could go back to sleep? No. No, I do not. No, I woke up to stop you. I can't go back to sleep now. Wait, wait, you suddenly got your memories back. Wait, well that's surprising. I scrambled the inside of your mind pretty well to help you sleep peacefully with some fixed chance. If I don't stop you, this world is gonna be destroyed. No. No, I am act actually Jonas Law, you should help me. If we combine our strengths. We should be able to cross dimensions and go back home. Go back home? What? Wait, what? Oh, right. Ion and Nilo are not originally from here. Please help. They're originally from someplace else. That's probably from the first game. If you're trying to sacrifice this world for something you want, that's wrong. I'll find a way to make you happy that doesn't involve destroying everything. Um, I don't think she's going to listen to it. She's unleashing us song magic. We gotta stop. We gotta get away. You 
can't escape. Right now, you're just a normal human. You can't even use song magic. I'm not escaping. I'm just gonna find a way to save you. I'll be back. I promise. Wait, if she's a normal human, how is she able to use song magic then? Alright, the are no surge program. I guess Earths are... I guess Ion had... Right, I... We already established Ion has that installed in her. Yeah, she jumped to her death. Don't try to catch me. You. Yep, we're gonna stop you from falling to your death. Well, that's nice of them anyway. I didn't actually think she'd jump. Oh well. Well, now we got now we got stuff to worry about, huh? I am awake now. Alright, where are we? What is this place? Yes, tell me. Tell me, what does Potagree do? Um, who are you? Are you a Charl? Are you a Charl? I am going to eliminate you. I am made of iron. Where is Ion? Ion? I have no idea. Wait. Um, are you not gonna attack me? And how are you talking? Yes, it's this thing. It's a, I'm a highly advanced robot. Why do you, um, like this? Apparently, uh, apparently, Earth is telepathic. Hey, I've used up everything I had already. So if I get attacked by any more guardians, I know it's pathetic, but please help me. I swear I'll pay you back. Oh yeah. By the way, what is that you're wearing, little dude? Okay, I guess I'll help you. Oh, uh, fine. I guess I'll help you. Well, thank you, um, Earthus. Earthus, is that my is that my name? Is it from an is it from an alternate earth? Alright now let's get going. You know, you kinda scared me at first, but now I feel much better with you around. you we shouldn't have any trouble getting back to Alright, let's go. Stop! Stop! Huh? Wait! Is that Ion? A guardian. Uh, uh, never mind. That's... Listen to my song. All right, an enemy boss. I will say that the song. Wait, that's not the same guardian that's attacking. That's attacking when the, on screen during the cutscene, man. Keep doing that. No problem. I'll keep doing that for you, Ion. Let's wipe them out. Alright, let's... Activate the song magic, go! Still dude Kamehameha, go! Yeah, this is more of a mini- of the mini-boss theme, man. Yes, I remember all that. I was inside your dream, linked to it somehow. Wait, I swear this guy had a different name when I first played it. Did they update the game then? Yes. Yes, that's right. That's a robot. Isn't that a I guess so. Yeah, that's pretty good. Can I call you Earthus too? 
Um. Uh. What if I say you cancel Ion? No, we're we're not gonna be jerks. No. Why would we be jerks to a cute girl? No. Or I mean, um. Right. We um need to play. We need to play this like a good guy. Yeah. Like a hero. Yeah. You can't just be randomly jerks to people. No. That's not nice, guys. And you guys want to be nice to people, don't you? Obviously. Yes. You should always be polite and kind to people, man. They already have it hard enough, man. Yeah, don't be a Karen. Yeah, that's a good that's good advice, I think. Hey look, it's guardians, but they're not active. Airy and bubbly. They are slightly airy and bubbly. But that's okay, Ion. Yeah, because you have some spicy things inside your heart, man. Once we start doing dives into your heart, that is. A shrine dedicated to God. Hey, wait, your arm's waiting. See? Ion is a good girl. She's very compassionate, man. Hey, what? We're using our underwear set. Wait, what? Um, Ion, what? That was very strange, I guess. Oh, I guess we got new items to find. Alright, let's take a look around, I guess. What is this right here? Oh yeah, that leads to where we came from. Place does look nice and quiet. There aren't any monsters around, that's good. Alright, let's head over here. Hopefully we can weave a new song magic with Ion. Wait, the white void. Oh, it's just telling me just telling me about a new place. Damn, the invaders have set up the invaders have set up their own village. I'd also put up a lot of green, man. That's a little nicer than, than Falan, man. Then again, we can't abandon Falan. Oh, what's that? Feel free to stop by the shop. Of course, we'll stop by the shop, of course. Oh, there's Bio Shop, okay. Yes, there sure are lots of Charles here. Hello there. Yes, may I buy some stuff? Oh, wow, you got flour, okay. And I'll take some of this. This village has a pretty famous hot spring. Wait, what? Why are you telling me about the hot spring? You can do purification ceremonies, okay? Okay, thank you for telling me about that. Glad my first instinct was to go over to the shop then. 
Yeah, this is a nice place. It's got plenty of cute fairies. Got plenty of sexy fairies. Or, I mean, um, not that I would know anything about that now. Hey, Vio, you can talk. You knew that... Yeah, Cast and Delta cannot use this shop, so we have to use Ion and Earth's man for it. Yeah, it's also a crafting shop, so we gotta do some crafting, guys. That's a Ginnum. Healing Retreat, it's a fancy name. I wonder if we can do anything in, in the bio shop, man. Like make some, like um, do a, leave a new song magic for Ion. The ground disappears, what? The planet is growing, sometimes parts of it disappear. Okay, thank you for telling me where to go next, at least. I guess I'll head over to that station eventually. First off, we should probably check out this shop. I'll buy a couple wires. And we'll trigger a scene. Trying to make some cold medicine. Girl don't get sick, so they don't need medicine. Wait, what? Is that true? Okay, please make some medicine. Yo, can we please do this crafting, man? Uh, tell us why you're making the medicine, at least. Thought it might make people happy, so I thought I'd make some cold medicine. It's easy to get that, so you don't... Nobody sells it. That's because nobody needs it, of course. It was super cold, and we got people coughing and looking pale. Oh, so you're trying to do it for humans, huh? Okay, then. Well, thank you for telling us, then. Sure, let's try. Oh, can I help buy on at least? Okay, let's... Now, can we make some cold medicine, though? I assume we can. This is a crafting shop, after all. Wait a minute, there's no- there's nothing we can craft here. They're trying to eat human food. As long as they don't eat- as long as they don't eat anything with lemons and limes, it should be good. Dietary supplement. Research on human medicine, found a supplement. Yeah, we don't... Yes, buy some supplements from Alex Jones, yeah. You guys should definitely do that. It's totally not a scam or anything, totally not. Okay, dietary supplements. Hashtag not a scam. What will this make? Yeah, let's try... Let's be at least a little bit like that.
All right, now. Oh, good. The shop is now open for business. That's good. And, of course, you have to craft here for the true ending of the game. We don't need anything from there. I'll start by making something here. Oh, this is weird. What is that stuff? They're poisonous to a human body. They're dumplings that are sold as pest extermination bait. They're poisonous dumplings? Oh, they, they're edible to people, but not but to humans. They're poisonous. Okay, so you do eat them. Um, so they're toxic, man. Too bad we don't have much of the spring powder. I assume we'll be able to get more later. Alright, we made a powerful nutrient. What is that? When fatigue and tiredness went away, it's a kind of inner. It's so quick, it's actually scary. No, I um, think it's really good, though. So it's actually an effective energy drink, unlike the actual energy drinks. Alright, let's make a couple of these. Bodybuilding RNA. Gives you solid muscles and repels attack. Basically, it's really good. Um, muscular ion, that's kind of scary. Don't talk like that. I. Yeah, um. Maybe muscular ion would be something that some people would be into, but, um, no. And I'm missing an ingredient for that. I'll buy a couple more of those. Tell you you don't. He's trying to make medicine for humans, but he um. It's actually, not that great. It's not selling too well. My humans buy some because it's never available before. That wasn't effective at treating colds. Need a supplement mystery, so I thought I'd make cold medicine. Well, supplements are not the same as cold medicine, obviously. Yeah, supplements are something that Alex Jones would sell to try and scam people, yeah? Nah, we don't want no supplements. Besides, I heard supplements are totally not a scam. Yeah, there, that seems, yeah, dietary supplements seem like, um, they wouldn't be too effective. Wish I could make the skin supplement now. Seems like your trigger is saying every few minutes, huh? Oh, we got a new recipe available. Alright, let's make a new wonder drug, I guess. Hopefully we'll be able to make the ultimate wonder drug that can make that can revive people from the grave. Yeah. That's actually what you need to make for the um, final ending, man. The reincarnation thing. It would be better than bad medicine, at least. 
All right, we need to get some of that. We need to get some of that spring powder, I guess. All right, let's see if we can at least make one thing. Now we don't have to think for that. Let's make this at least. There we go, suspicious bath powder. What does that do? Oh, I'm the worst, what do you mean? Now you're trying to give it to Ian, what is that? Wait, what do you mean? Wait, what? What do you mean? Why is it sexual harassment? Something lovers put in the bath and then, um, I guess you use it like normal bath powder, but that, we don't need lovers to do that. Never said anything about it being bath powder, it's hot thick bath, hot thick spring powder. Thick hot spring powder, is it food? That's for, um, why did you make it a food? They can food properly? That's only not suspicious or anything now. Yeah, I'm missing quite a few things before I can make the other things. seems like a good place to go, but we should probably visit over here. This is your first time. Train your minds and bodies so you can... Oh, enter your soulscape, huh? The Shara will have song magic confirmed. But our soul level's too low. Is this kind of like a gun in him? Yes, please, Mir, please do it. I'll see everything in your heart, including the weird stuff. Yeah. Things get weird there. I'm really sorry. It's quite okay, right? All right, let's dive. Alright, we should try Nelico. Oh, Nelico, what is this world? Don't need to be alarmed. What are we here for? So starting the day, we got all new items for machines. We're starting at the store. What are you going to do there? Oh, wow, this is very strange. Uh, so where do we start at least? Oh well. Guess we could check out the store. Okay, let's check out what it is. Always, sli always slippers, black telephone, laundry clip, what? I'll do it. 
Great a vending machine at least. Oh good, we got something. That's good, we beat that one. Over here. What are we doing here in my room? I can't believe it, how, how smash it was. Felt like I smashed it myself. Don't understand the mechanics at all. Part of my plan to trap the lighthouse keeper. Oh, right. Got it. Yes. I don't really get it. Well, let's be a little bit nice. There. Can't go there. There. How much does it say? I don't think I have enough for that. Not letting me go to any of the places. I'm supposed to choose what else here. No. I have a plan to trap the lighthouse keep. Don't get it. So she basically destroyed this house. Still can't go anywhere. I mean, we're supposed to try all those things, huh? I'll do it. Yes, please. That's pretty good, but... Gotta do more of them, man. Do it. Oh, we don't have enough. Don't have enough, man. Alright, I can't do anything. At least we got them salt, salt gristles, at least. Looked really fun, man. Looks like we're gonna need a lot more points for that, though. We need to grind on some enemies. That's okay. Looks like we can catch a train here. 
Tickets, what? I'm sure I'll have some tickets for us. Gotta find the tickets, huh? Guess we're gonna have to go look for Charles then, that will have the ticket then. Probably be over here. No, in fact it was this one. Huh? Over here again. Got some that spring water. That's an ingredient that we need. Yes, I'm. Our need enemies here. Good thing, Ian. No problem. Glad I'm doing great. I'm glad I'm doing so good. Good, we've got him. There we go, we took him out. Strong enemies, though. I wish we level up a little. Clacking on that line so we can hit right there. There we go. And if we do this, we'll be able to get more dive points for later. Could probably do that, huh? Close to filling it up all the way. Do it, Ion. Blow them up. Good job. You did really well. Oh, we did. Oh, and we got a couple level ups, too. Now we level up twice, huh? Is that a ticket? Don't we return it to the Charles? We need to return him, yeah. The Ion agrees with me. I knew that was the right move to do. Grass, we're gonna do that as an ingredient. Now this place looks like a rundown village, huh? Wonder if people haven't been living here in a long time, man. Definitely look for a little bit more ingredients. Ring powder, of course. Definitely fight a little bit more enemies. No problem, Ion. I will definitely listen to it. Alright, now let's wipe them out. Take him down. Yeah, Alright, now get him, robot. Luckily, these guys are not too hard. Especially since we leveled up on the slimes earlier. And we got him. I wanted to attack that one. Wow. 
And I'm glad you like that, I am. Let's take him out. There we go. Alright, let's activate her song. I like her songs too. I like Ion songs, they're pretty good. I might do it I might do the Ion ending with her and Earths again. Oh I haven't seen Built in Cass's ending, so I might as well I could do that one too. Now this game is definitely getting a little bit good. Got a little bit more ingredients. Alright, let's return the ticket to the shuttle. Over here. Can't steal their tickets, man. Nah, we gotta be... Nah, we're playing lawful good, guys. Oh, you already got new ones, okay. Oh, thank you for the spring powder. Gave us some tickets, huh? Probably buy you some more flour. On my way, thank you for the powder. At least. You know, we've been going on for quite a while. At least we awakened Ao. We awakened Ion. Cute. Here we'll use the Heart of Light. The only slug magic we got right now. I do plan to get more of them, but I'll need to grind a little bit. Gotta attack that one. Do the wave attack that hits them on the line. attack on the line. There we go. Taking them out like that. Blast, blast, blast. Love those pistols. Where is he getting the ammo for it from? I don't know. Good job. Almost full up. There we go, we'll just wipe out the wave. And after this, I'm going to stop. Not bad at all. There we go, another level up for Ion and Ears. Flint. Oh, some more spring powder, cool. Actually, no. Not ending it quite yet. At least go. At least go to the station. See what else we can do. And then we can enter the station. I don't really care for trains. Yeah, those give you the option to be a jerk if you really want to. But nah. Let's be nice to Ian. After all, she has some lovely song magic that's very lovely. Also does lots of cool things. Ooh, double decker, man. Double decker train, that's really cool. That's like a that's a lot like a double decker bus only on rails, man. You guys seen double decker buses, haven't ya? Of course, they're really cool to go around in tours, man. Yeah, 
Hey, there's some- there's a person here. There are several people here. Why does she want to destroy the entire world? Or a story of a planet that's referenced from the first game that we never got. Probably. Not that I would know. We have technology that can summon souls from across time and space. Now and I were brought we're brought here with that technology from about five thousand. Oh, Nello is from five thousand years ago. Oversight unique people from her dimension. He was forced to sleep for a very long time. Brought here because of my oversight ability. I'm supposed to use my power as a for a mass planetary migration. It was on the brink of destruction, huh? Don't want to return? The world was basically destroyed and, um... You were forced to find... You were forced into another world that wasn't theirs. Nello wants to destroy the world because she's unhappy here, I guess. Maybe she's really homesick. You know, that kind of reminds me of, um, Superboy Prime. Of course, not quite- of course, Superboy Prime is not quite as mature as Nello is. So the reasoning is similar. I don't like this place. It's not like my home at all, so I'm going to destroy it all. Oh, I can't believe her. I can't believe this place is so friendly with sexy fairies, man. Maybe the people of Falan are wrong. The ancient city. Wow, what is that machine? I don't think that's very practical whatsoever. All right, let's go. Look, let's go. At least it's added to the world map. Well, there's sure are lots of Charles here. Oh, can I buy something? I oh, got plenty of these. Got plenty of power splitters and flat resin boards. Buy some sham flower. Thank you. The Enlightened Sovereign. Jill. Yeah, so Jill's pretty much made herself made herself put herself in power in this place. And in what? All right, thank you for giving me more places to go. Uh, relatively speaking. Oh, they added some places on the map. I guess I could go there in the next episode. Right now, I want to gather more materials, and then, and I will grind a little bit. We're low level compared to Cass and Delta. We will eventually get the ability to switch between Ion and Earths and Cass and Delta, though. At least we're strong enough to beat the normal enemies, at least. That I like. At least the combat in this game is pretty fun, plus you fight waves of enemies. Pretty easy to get XP. And plenty of dive points too. 
Sure we can. Alright, we did it, and we got an extra turn in. All I gotta do is break the end. All I gotta do. Most fights are a little tricky since they connect, since you can. since they're a little bit harder to stop. Luckily, the game's not too hard on normal difficulty. At least, not unless you really rush the game. Of course, it's. Of course, all video games are very. Of course, most RPGs are very easy if you over level. And just, and just curb stomp the enemies that you come across. But some video games will actually punish you for that. Some video games, it doesn't really matter what level you're at. Not bad at all. Good, we're getting level up. We got some time grass, too. Might as well get more of that spring powder. I could have sworn there was a save point here. Alright, let's check out what this area is all about. Hey, doesn't this area look a little familiar? There's some stronger enemies here too. To do Don't worry, I will definitely back you up. Really up. That wasn't too hard. I'll definitely try to keep it going at least. I don't really remember where our barriers are. And we did it. Alright, let's activate our song. Wipe out the enemies. Yeah, those were a bunch of boars. Definitely a lot less enemies, and that's good. Good thing, I think. This looks a little bit tougher. That up ahead. Children who have inherited the wit those who work tireless, your help is and is still the leader who wander blindly through the darkness. It is our duty to save them. We must purge. Oh, you're also in the cult, aren't you? That is the reason we have gathered here. There was a time, although as a human, the seeds of demons within my fellow humans destroyed. He's gone, Cuckoo. That, that seems like the only possible redemption for but Corzal, the Lord of Genem. I found myself deeply moved by his. There are other humans living in darkness who also seek sap. I pray that the souls of the. Yep, she's gone, Cuckoo. This is a bunch of cult nonsense. Have you been brainwashed by Jill or something? Please. May this song go.
activating its own magic. Alright guys, I'm going to stop here. I am going to grind. And later I'm going to do some crafting and also unlock some more song magic for Ion. That is when we get back into the game. Right now though, I think this is a good stopping point. I'm sorry I didn't really get to do much. Now, and then we're going to see what Canon's song is all about. I thank you guys for watching and I hope you had plenty of fun. Alright, I really hope we can just leave here. Human world. Yeah. It's a whole bunch of cult nonsense. What was the sin that she committed? Is that like in the first game or something? That would help. Is that what helped destroy the world or something? Yeah, she's definitely involved with Jill, Jill somehow. Oh well. I love you guys. Remember, play games and have fun, okay? Bye-bye now.